Are you a homosexual? And have you ever participated in homosexual activities? Those were two questions that were proposed to me on the day I took the oath to protect this country and its citizens from enemies, foreign and domestic. That was over 20 years ago, prior to the enactment of the don't ask, don't tell policy. The time is now. We cannot wait any longer. You have the power to influence and create change. We need you to take action. We cannot do it alone. Yes, we started this movement, but it's up to you. It's your responsibility to continue to pass on the torch of faith, hope, and love. What are you willing to do for our lesbian, gay, bisexual, and transgender brothers and sisters who are service members and veterans in their families that have been impacted by the Don't Ask, Don't Tell law? I, yesterday, with 12 other people, went to the White House fence and handcuffed ourselves, demanding change. We wanted the Commander-in-Chief, President Barack Obama, to see us because he can no longer ignore us. But we need your help to make this happen. We have less than four weeks to create this change. What are you willing to do? I did it, and if a small-town black girl from Texas can influence Senator Webb to change his vote to repeal the don't ask, don't tell policy, just imagine what you are able to do. I'm leaving it up to you. I dare you to. I dare you. 